Hey guys, uh, today I want to talk about meta fields and how you can use them to improve your Google Shopping feed. Um, this is a new feature by us. Uh, we help you to map any meta field that you might have uh, to, you, to your Google Shopping feed. So before we start, let's talk about what meta fields are. Right? Meta fields are a new, it's an existing feature that's uh, used a lot by uh, Shopify merchants. Uh, what it allows you to do is to have very custom parameters for every single product, collection, uh, variant, etc. Okay. There are multiple apps uh, which, which, uh, in, through which you can add uh, meta fields. I'm currently using one of the app, Meta Fields Guru. Um, so, for example, if I go to products, I can see that I'm using three different meta fields for uh, this particular product. So, why do we use meta fields again? Uh, meta fields help you to extend the functionality of Shopify. Shopify has a limited set of parameters available, limited set of fields available. And using meta field, you can expand it to as many as you want. Right Now, uh, why would you use meta fields uh, in Google Shopping feed? Um, this is a typical use case. If you are a multi-brand retailer, uh, you might have SKU uh, and SKU as an internal metric and MPN is usually stored in a meta field, right? That's a typical uh, case that I have seen with uh, most multi-brand retailers. In that, but by default um, from Shopify, SKU is identified as MPN in Google Shopping feed. So uh, the meta field, what it allows you to do is to override that setting. I'll quickly show you how to do that via our app. Click on settings, click on feed. You should see a new uh, section, which is product meta fields. I have enabled this field, uh, product meta fields. But if you're new to Adnabu, you might see this section as locked. Uh, you can unlock it. And once you unlock it, uh, what you need to do is select the, uh, the type of resource uh, for which you have defined the meta field. Um, and what do you want to map it to in Google Shopping feed? So let me map it to multi-pad and the meta fields namespace and uh, uh, key, right? These are, uh, these are the only uh, information that we need uh, from you to map the meta fields to uh, Google Shopping feed. Uh, please note that we don't uh, have an option for you to add meta fields or like edit meta fields. That has to be done by you using any other app that you're already using. But we uh, have the functionality of reading from the meta field data. Um, hope this helps. Uh, hope this uh, helps you to add more customization to uh, Google Shopping feed. MPN is just one of the things that you can do. You can override your title. You can override your GTIN number. Um, you can do as many customization as you want uh, with our Google Shopping feed. Uh, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, please let us know. Bye-bye.